morning, my country people, and welcome to KTN Life and Style. This is Artistic Tuesday, and I am, of course, your hostess with the Moses Tendiwe Yego, the Kenya Sax Chronicles there, bringing us in with such a romantic mood this chilly morning. And, of course, we have so, so, so much planned for you during this show, so you better stay put because we are just getting started. Of course, you know we have spoken word, we have visual art, and of course, we have our musical section. And before we get deep into things right here, I want you to first of all follow us on at KTN Life and Style. And remember to use the hashtags KTN Life and Style and hashtag Artistic Tuesday. Tell us how you're feeling this morning. How are you feeling the show? Are you vibing with us? And yo, you guys, I have a surprise for you. I am not writing solo today. I want to introduce to you our new host. She's making her debut right here, right now. Her name is Tebby. Maritim, Tabby, please, can you bring your gorgeous self Good onto morning. this stage Good right morning. now? Good morning. Good morning, Tabby. I'm so absolutely excited to have you. First of all, you are looking. Mm, 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 mm. Thank you. Thank gorgeous you. I tried my best Tabby. just for you. Tell us, how are you feeling? Are you feeling excited? I'm feeling good. I'm I am buzzing. I'm so excited for this show. I'm mm -hmm. so happy for everyone who's joined us today. Thank you so much for coming. Um, we have a really, really amazing show up today for you mm -hmm. so stay have, put Tabby. yes what we do. do we have today we have really good music live music Sa the Sa Kenya Sax Chronicles are in the house and um, we also have visual artists who are going to do live art can indeed, you believe it indeed Tabby and let us not even forget the most crucial thing today we need to remind you season two of ktn i can sing is back it's you on. need to get on your facebook right now all you need to do is send in a two minute video of yourself singing tell us where you live give us your contacts and you should upload this video on the ktn facebook page absolutely and maybe you could stand a chance to win tebby i don't know about you, you could i don't know I don't about know. I you might, i might try because i think i can sing are you up for it <laughs> are you up for it did you see masio pandit the competition is tough wow yeah i know the competition is tough so I you need know. to we'll get on that right now and of course we want to talk to our musical guest for the day the kenya sax Chronicles. That just sounds like the title of some kind of a like movie or a novel. It felt like I was on a romantic dinner I know, when I, I came know. in. Wow. Exactly. Wow. Setting the vibe. So let's go and take, you know, a bit of a look here and see what exactly is happening. Talk to us, the Kenya Sachs Chronicles. I want you guys to introduce yourselves. So we're gonna start right here. So you can go up to the microphone and tell us exactly who you are. Yes, good morning everybody. We are delighted to be here, Kenya Sax Chronicles. My name is Samuel Mwaura. I play the tenor saxophone, and uh, basically I love music, and it's been something that's inspired me all my life, and I've always wanted to play the saxophone. Yes, yes, you're going to have to explain to us exactly what that... Tenor saxophone, what? Tenor saxophone. Okay, you're going to explain that to us. Let's go to our next saxophonist. Hello, my name is Gabriel Wakabu but I go by the name Gabby. I play the alto saxophone, and I'm really glad to be here. Ooh, we're glad yes. to have you. And you? Good morning. My name is Chris Seki, but my stage name is Chris on sax. And um, it's good to be with you, and also to minister to you this morning. Mm -hmm. We are so happy. I play alto sax. It's a E-flat instrument. And uh, that's what I, I love doing. All right. I hope Thank you guys you are watching. remembering this. Yeah. Alto sax, tenor mm -hmm. sax. This is a lesson right here. All right. The beautiful, gorgeous lady. I'm so happy, by the way, that there's a female on this team. Yes. Yes, Tabby. <laughs> yes. Represent, girl. Yes. Um, my name is Patricia, but I can call me Trish. I play the alto sax. Yeah. Uh, All right. That's just about it. Okay, <laughs> Patricia. Let's move up there. Hello everybody, I'm Larry. Uh, I do the alto sax and piano. All right, yep. thank you, thank you. I love the hair. <laughs> All right, we have our last member of the Sax Chronicles. Yeah, uh, good morning guys. My name is Edward, uh, but most people call me the Nyati. I play the soprano sax, uh, straight soprano sax. Mm -hmm. uh, I do music as a hobby, mostly. All right, yep. Tabby, what do you want to know from I these guys? I have a burning question. 
please. Mm -hmm. I don't know about you, mm -hmm. but for me, whenever my parents paid for an instrument, I would go one lesson, <laughs> two lessons, and give up. Yeah. So what keeps you guys going? Mm -hmm. Maybe we can start here. Yeah. Um, well, it's um, inspirational and watching people who've done it really well. Mm -hmm. So you really want to do something that will be outstanding, something that will bless somebody. So you keep working at the instrument. Mm -hmm. I mean, you keep working at the instrument and working at the instrument until you get it. But mainly we are inspired also by people who've really done it well. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right, that's absolutely amazing. Yes. So can you tell us exactly what keeps you, you know, motivated to stay in this game? Yeah, me. First of all, I'm a Christian. And I wanted to do something for God that is unique. Because when you go to churches, you find there are so many guitarists, there are so many pianists, there are so many drums. And saxophones are a unique instrument and it's expensive. Yeah. So that means you have to have a passion also to purchase it, knowing what you are going to do and who you are doing it for. So I wanted to do for God something unique that is, it will help me keep me uh, into the presence of God and also um, pursue my passion because personally I love music mm -hmm. and that's what I, 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 I do for a living. Oh, I love wow. it. I love it. I feel that's like amazing. I feel the spirit already, <laughs> Tebi. I feel <laughs> the spirit too. already. But before we get too into the spirit, mm -hmm. we'd like to know what's the history of your group? Where did you begin? How did you get together? Can you give us a, a rundown? Uh, well, uh, Kenya Sax Chronicles is just a group of saxophonists from all over Kenya. Uh, we just uh, formed a group so that we can have a forum for us to discuss our saxophones and uh, matters related to them. Yeah. So uh, all of us belong to different bands and different uh, places we, we play at. So uh, in the sax group, at least we have a chance to discuss matters particularly on sax. And once in a while we do events uh, or meet each other to, for jam sessions and so on. Right. So there, there are actually other groups as well, but uh, we are like less than a tenth because we are over about 70 people in that group so uh, because of short notice we are just the ones who are maybe available but it's actually a larger group we can fill this whole place wow all right yeah. i want to know what is the biggest event or biggest festival that you guys have ever played together mm -hmm. in As a uh, together it's i don't think we've done we we used to there's a one of our members is called moses so he used to do street saxophone uh, somewhere on Aga Khan walk. So most of us used to join him and jam together, but most of us have been at different uh, uh, jazz festivals or events uh, separately, but we've not really done a joint event, which uh, we were discussing that because uh, last week, I think it was, uh, it was International Day of the Saxophone. So yeah. we are planning to do something maybe later on, even if it's belated. So probably that will be one thing which will include all of us. All right, so he talked a bit about his inspiration and he talked about God being the main reason why he does this. Can we hear from each of you exactly what inspired you to start playing the saxophone? Because it's not exactly like an instrument that, you know, anybody would just pick up and say, oh yeah, you know, I want to play the saxophone. It's a very, as he said, it's a very expensive and very complicated type of instrument. So what pushed you guys? What was the drive behind that decision? Uh, ladies first. Of for course. <laughs> um, well, for me, I, 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 there's a time I was just browsing on YouTube and this uh, suggestions must watch, and there's this guy playing saxophone. It was it was actually a tenor. The song was what was the song? Just a, a nice uh, Christian song, and I finally loved the song. I just liked it. You no, know, I, I was like, man, I need to to play this thing. You know. So after a while, after about. Six months after watching mm -hmm. the video, you know, saving up because yeah, it, it's not cheap. <laughs> and yeah, I bought the sax. I I learned, and yeah, here I am now. So how long did it take you to learn how the, to play the saxophone? Is it something that you take like a lot of time? <laughs> well, for mm, it it depends. You know, people learn at different uh, paces, but for me, it took me about a month maybe to get the basics, and then. From there, it's been you know just growing continuously because you know you, you can't uh, you can't outgrow it. You know every every moment th music keeps on evolving, so it's still a learning process. But to get the basics, I can say it took me a month. Uh, Tebi, I think we can hack that one month. I, let's start. One Actually, month is not a lot, by the way. <laughs> Me, I can handle that. Let's do it. Yes, Tebi, I'll hold you accountable. 
By the way. <laughs> By the way. Why don't you give us another performance? Yes, thank you. Mm. Please do.
I was really hoping you would play that song because that is one of my absolute favorites. You guys, I just want to give you a reminder before we continue here. Remember, KTN I Can Sing Season 2 is back, Tebby. Yes, Take it your is. shot. The time is now. <laughs> the deadline for applications is the 20th of November. What you need to do, it's very simple. Just send a two-minute video to our Facebook page. Tell us where you live, give us your contacts, and bam, bam, like this, you could be a Sue pasta. So make sure you do that right now. And I really, really hope that you're interacting with us on social media. Remember, our handles are at KTN Life and Style. Use the hashtag KTN Life and Style and hashtag Artistic Thursday. Now let's get right back into it. The Kenya Sax Chronicles. I just love that title. Tebby, I just love it. It's so, amazing. It's so grand. It's yes. so grand, Tebby. Tebby, I know there's something that you want to know from these guys. I, I have a question. Ask them. You said there's about 70 of you. Mm -hmm. yeah? yeah. Do you ever perform together? And if you do, what are the logistics? Like, how is it planning a concert with 70 artists together? Well, it's uh, really difficult because everyone has their own different schedule. Like, people have gigs. Some guys have gigs every day. Uh, some of us maybe once a week. Uh, and so on. So it's really hard to get the whole group at once. Uh, so what we do is we maybe try planning in, well in advance and get as many as possible. It's really hard to get all 70 of us a, a, in one place. So we try as much as possible uh, to just probably balance. We've not really done it because it's, it's been, some of us even have never seen each other in the group because wow. like we are so many and mm -hmm. some are in Mombasa, some mm -hmm. are in Kisumu, different places. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's the logistics are uh, can be crazy, mm -hmm. yeah. I but can uh, only imagine. me too. Yeah. Wow, yeah. Mm -hmm. that sounds absolutely crazy. So now I want to get into your individual music taste. Mm -hmm. I'm sure every one of you has, you know, your icons yeah, in mm -hmm. the saxophone, should I call it the jazz, the jazz mm -hmm. industry. So what are the top two played? songs or albums for you guys right now currently who are you just grooving to and bumping to you know day and night you're like i can't get enough of this artist mm -hmm. we can start ladies first mm -hmm. yes you're smiling so much they don't you want to answer <laughs> um well i can say i i honestly don't know i just listen to many mm -hmm. <laughs> many players mm -hmm. but i can say what the person who I'm currently looking at his videos, he's called Scott Paddock. Mm -hmm. Yes, he, he does. <laughs> he does. He does. He he doesn't do covers, but he he transcribes saxophone music, which is which is amazing. All right. Yes. All right. Who wants to go next? Who wants to tell us? Maybe I'll. I'll I have a, a courage of promoting our East African community, mm -hmm. yeah, like you. Uh, there are so many people who are inspiring me from abroad, but mostly emphasis I'm putting it on East African community. Mm -hmm. We have so many brands from our own that we celebrate a person like Isaiah Katumwa. Yeah. He's a brand in East Africa mm -hmm. and uh, he's motivating, he's, he's, motivate, he's inspiring most of the young people mm -hmm. to begin something. Me, I'm looking up to him. And also when you go abroad, before I celebrate even like a person like um, uh, maybe uh, those saxophone guys in the US, kind of a uh, uh, Kirk Wyram. Yeah. yeah, there are so many people who are inspiring us, but me, mostly I'm focusing on East African because uh, East African, we are just growing in music. True. Especially like now, some if you move like, <laughs> one kilometer from uh, from here and you ask somebody what is this instrument mm -hmm. called they don't know it true, there true. are so many young people who are inspiring to enter into music even singing or play an instrument mm -hmm. but it, they are not motivation and maybe one thing i was uh, i can tell them that uh, if you have a zeal of learning music um procrastination is an enemy of progress mm -hmm. Don't procrastinate. Start where you are. Even if you don't want, if you don't want to have somebody to sponsor you, start in the churches. Go to church or start within your group, like the way how we've done. Mm -hmm. We just came up with a, uh, a, an, an a idea of gathering all the Kenya saxophones mm -hmm. to come together to do something, and we've started. 
And before you know, who knows, maybe we will come with all of those 70 here. Now, this is our first time to appear on TV as Sax Chronicles. And there are so many of our guys who are watching us, and we are encouraging them. This thing is real. Just come. Don't talk on group or talk. I saw them. Come and join us. Bring that uh, talent on, on table. Mm -hmm. And we serve people. And we serve, uh, we, we minister to our fellow colleagues. Mm -hmm. And we, maybe somebody is the way how he is out there because you've not come to inspire that person. But if we, all of us come out, we will develop our East African region and mm -hmm. we will not be able to import other music like yeah. Nigerian movie, uh, Congolese movies. We have yeah. our own. Yeah. Yes. Uh, exactly. Like yeah. now, if you go to parties, you find a uh, wedding. They play Nigerian movies and Congolese movies. Yeah. Oh, I mean, true. I mean music. <laughs> yeah. But we have all our own music. Yeah. You understand? Mm -hmm. And guys who are there, support us. If you see guys, a young person is doing something, mm -hmm. they should support us and encourage us. Mm -hmm. Great. That's yeah. so amazing. We'll be back with you guys right mm -hmm. after the break. So we're going to take a commercial break now, but we'll see you immediately after the break and. We will have, um, I can, don't forget to move in, send your videos in for I Can Sing. Mm -hmm. The auditions are on right now. Send your videos. Um, I don't know if Tandiwe is sending a video. No, I'm sending, uh, by the way, by the I'm <laughs> already we, rehearsing. I'm ready. Please, you know me, I'm going to shine by myself. Tabby, I don't do no duets, honey. So like, stay with <laughs> us. After the break, we will have Kenya Sachs um, Chronicles still here. And we also have some visual artists and more. So don't leave. The winner is Massey. We are back. To participate on I Can Sing Season 2, record a two-minute video of you singing your best, introduce yourself, where you live, and your contacts, then sing. Inbox the video to our Facebook page, KTN I Can Sing. Submissions close on 20th November 2018. 